There are people right now that need what you have. There are people that need you to find your inner voice and help them. But you don't do anything by it. Why don't you help these people? Why don't I help these people? Why doesn't anybody help anybody? Most of the time it's because we believe that what we have, the skill sets we have, aren't that special. You might be an amazing cook, but because it comes second nature to you, you don't think anything of it. So why would you try and provide value to people? Why would you try to showcase your skills of cooking and show people about cooking when you just think it's normal? If you think it's normal, you basically don't think that there's any point of you sharing your expertise. And I say expertise because it is an expertise. And when you add your own unique twist to it and your own unique way of explaining things, people can really understand your way of explanation. And the reason I'm basically talking to you about this right now is because I'm currently waiting for, for a mate and we're gonna go to the beach, gonna go for a dip in the sea. It's gonna be bloody freezing, but you know, sometimes it's good to get out of your comfort zone and that, and I was just waiting outside here, but it started to piss down, classic English summer, yep, yep, it's, it's the middle of July right now, well, end of July, and yeah, you know, it's just classic weather, and I just started reading this book on my Kindle, it's called Expert Secrets by Russell Brunson, I've talked about it before on here, uh, it's a trilogy about how to market an online business, and he said something that really stood out to me, like big time, hence why I'm making this video right now. And he said that essentially, by me not talking about things that I am actually quite an expert in, all right, call it an expert, but it's not necessarily an expert, it's just I might know a lot about a certain subject, more than you perhaps, I am offering you a disservice by not talking about it. So as I said, in the same way that you might be a great cook or I don't know a fantastic motocross driver or a fantastic runner by you not sharing your knowledge and your skills and your way of explaining you are offering people a disservice you have been hand gifted this gift from God or the universe or you know Allah whatever you want to call it you have been handed this skill set and you've been handed this craft to share with other people and you're doing nothing by it, you are offering people a disservice. Now, going back to me again, I know about the gym. I know about boxing. I know about eating a healthy diet. So might Bob. Bob also might know about all these things. But Jake over here might understand my point of view more than Bob or he might prefer Bob's point of view to mine the fact of the matter is everyone has value and information that they can share that somebody else is going to understand so when people often say that the market is flooded there's too many people doing that there's too many people doing that that's a load of bullshit bro because everyone can provide value and as I said by not doing that you are providing people a disservice so that's why when I'm making these YouTube videos, when you see other people making YouTube videos, they are essentially providing value to you, either value or entertainment. If you've got both of them, then, you know, you're doing a good job. But um, yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's one of those things. We're working on the entertainment thing. But yeah, going with value as well. But yeah, so anyway, as I was saying, I was reading this book, I've come across those things, and I can't remember if there's something else that I wanted to say. But yeah, essentially, you might not think that what you have is a big deal because it comes second nature to you, but to somebody else, that thing that you have, that skill set that you have is incredible. So share it, talk to people and help people, bro, because we all need each other. I need you, you need me, and we all need our, our mates and our brothers and sisters. So speak to people, bro. Do it today. Go out and... Um, that's all I have to say. Believe you can, and you're more than halfway there.